Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to give you guys a house tour. It's a long awaited video. I did do what a house tour at one point or another, but I don't know where that is in the archives. So I decided to do a casual one for you guys today. It is not anything super special, but I figured, you know what? It shows you the house nonetheless. And for those of you guys who are new and are wanting to see the house, this is the opportunity. So I'm going to do it in a vlog style format and I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, oh, so here I am. I am standing by, um, oops. I'm standing by my front entrance, front door. This is where I'm at, entryway. Right here you have our beautiful stairway leading all the way up to upstairs. And as you can see, there are two entryways, one on this side and one on that side, right there. So coming in from this side, over here is our formal living room, which you guys have seen a ton. But for those of you who are new and are seriously wanting to get like a proper house tour, this is what it looks like. I've got my car seat over there in the corner. Should be leaving that in the car from now on. But we've got some guitars in the corner as well. And um, yeah, got my baby bag here. I kind of leave it here periodically because I can just grab it and take it out of the car. But here is our formal dining area. I have you made these chairs by, from scratch, guys, these benches, and we have two of them. It's fall. It's the season of fall. That's, yeah, it's fall, so we have these things currently on the table. And um, just like our homeschooling thing in the background, we also have a couple of things. My mail thing fell down, which I need to put away, and some unopened things. Piano, and of course, you'll see little moments of baby stuff here and there. So, continuing this way. It leads to our kitchen, which is where all the cooking takes place, all the hanging out. We also have our breakfast area where we tend to eat a lot at. This is just what we like to do. And because it's by the windows, like the bay, not the bay windows, the sliding doors, which we have two of, it gets a lot of natural light. So it's really well lit in the day. And I really like that. Moving on, this is our... Uh, family room. It's a little bit busy at the current moment. Dog bed, rocking chair, and this is just the area where we hang out. My baby swing is just gotta go. Like we don't use that anymore. And the computer desk area is always like a giant mess. I clean it and clean it, and so ignore that. But this is our hangout area where we like to just hang out and have a good time. So um, above it, we've got our formal family picture arrangement we have yet to like include pictures that have zoe in it or even just some of the up-to-date pictures these are ones that we've had previously and it's our family wall so i think if anything we're probably going to extend on it but i had to come back and film this little spot because i realized that i just kind of filmed a uh, downward uh I don't know, like a bottom heavy video. There was like nothing showcasing the top part. So um, in the corner, we have a fireplace there, which I currently have a Z representing the zebra tribe. I did not show you guys that as well because it's an area that needs a little tending to. And oh, above here, above here, the TV unit. We have thought about putting the TV unit up at the t um, on the wall, but we are currently trying to decide like if we should just put something there I'm thinking like a big arrow but I'm having a hard time finding that so um yeah comment down below if you have anything that I could put in between these two pillars or maybe they have to go I don't know into the hallway that way and that way moving on I'm going to take you guys upstairs really quickly So moving on, we've got this bunk area here where our girls, got this bunk area here where our girls share this room. It's a bit of a mess, so we won't intervene too much. Tomorrow, Saturday, they will clean the rest of that. Right across from there, we've got mixed room and it's a work in progress. Yeah. Coming in here, the girls have their own bathroom. This is their cute little bathroom that they will be cleaning tomorrow, come Saturday. Next, we've got a linen closet here. I'm not going to open our linen closet to show you. I'm sure it's um, okay. Yeah. To, yeah. And then we've got Zoe's room right here. 
Um, like I said, nothing is perfect, guys. We're trying, we're working on stuff, but this is Zoe's room. I've gone ahead and changed it a little bit. I angled her chair just straight. Her, she has a toy bin underneath there. I do like to push it further along so you don't see it. She's, I did that to make room for her laundry bin, which is right here. I don't know if it's gonna stay here or not, but that's where it's at for now. Uh, she's got a bed in here, her change table, nice pictures. Ignore this. These things are all the laundry that just came out that no longer fit her, which I'm gonna be putting away inside the bin, inside the closet. Stuff I need to take out and wash for her. And um, yeah, so behind her room, she's got like a, what do you call it, a coat hook. We, we actually like to install one of these in every girl's room so they have um, somewhere to hang their stuff. Got a picture from a friend. And I really did put it up, it's right there. <laughs> um, oh yeah, and by the way, we the girls and I made that sign for the Zoe's room. And um, then I purchased that thing at Winners. So over here to the left, oh, not, over here let's not forget this big old sign the zebra tribe sign which our friend made and it was at my baby shower and it's honestly one of like the best gifts ever and i will forever keep it <laughs> so then underneath here we've got like some of her cards and just some little signs it's not as organized as i need it to be i'm thinking of getting another one of these shelves or something but we'll see how it goes and we also have some bookshelves that we want to put up here for her i just have to paint them and then obviously on the other side is our room which you guys have seen a ton of which we now you know host the baby's now we, we just now we just host the baby's crib on the one side I've got laundry that I'm trying to put away but overall this is our room so yeah you guys have seen our room enough times we've got I've got a walk-in closet and hubby's got a closet aside from me and then inside our um We've got an ensuite. We have our own ensuite, which just has a toilet, a shower, and our vanity, which is a little bit of a disaster right now. And then I'll show you guys downstairs really quickly. I think you guys have seen the basement as well, but we'll be going down there in a moment. Like I said, I hope you guys don't mind this house tour. I guess the house tour is really just to show you guys the house, but I tried to do this before. Oh. I should show you guys this as well. We're upstairs. This is what the hallway looks like. It's pretty spacious. And of course the balcony overlooks downstairs. You know, so security. <laughs> Hi. Hi. because now you can understand why I have to recruit help to clean this place and to keep for it to stay the way that it is for the most part you know we live oh I forgot to show you over here we also have like a what do you call it I don't know what it's called like a banister alcove thing banister. alcove banister thing which people need to take up that sock and yeah. their magic kit and adventures in an odyssey That's book okay. that needs to go downstairs you guys can understand why I need help to get this place together. Oh, I didn't show you. So I also wanted to show you over here. I think I showed you. This is like another hallway off of the main level where we've got our coat closet. Got. Is someone in here? What's that? The bathroom. We've got our laundry room. So this is our powder room, guys. The one on the main floor. Um, obviously came back two minutes later. Um, we just replaced this light up here. I don't know, it's nothing special, but I thought I'd show it to you. Um, and we've got this mirror here. So everything so far in this house is pretty much as is. We've yet to begin doing any upgrades. That is something we're definitely working on, working towards, but as with anything, you have to be patient so things can fall into place. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini video and thank you so much for watching. If you like this, don't forget to leave a comment down below and to also um, 
share this video guys and give it a like give it a thumbs up i will do a part two showing you the basement it is a bit of a bit of a chaos because we're currently reorganizing it the space so it can serve with, for all the different areas that we need it you guys see that we have a large library down there that area is going to be staying put but we're kind of organizing like a little play zone for the baby slash um fitness area workout area which we currently have but it's not as it's not making any sense so I'm going to be reorganizing it and then I'll show it to you and we also have like our storage and whatnot down there so it's a great space to stay tuned for um you guys will see it in the next coming either days or a week or so so um hope you guys enjoyed today's video and much love guys bye Hi guys, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to join the tribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs>